Have you ever been walking along the beach and you see all the boats already out at sea, even though it's early in the morning? How do they get out? Where do they know where to go to? In this video, I'm going to take you through a typical morning in the life of a coastal fisherman, starting from when they launch the boat, and then we'll look at all the other things. And remember to watch to the end, you're going to see a unique style of fishing I'm not sure you've ever come across before. So first thing first, I used to see these boats parked along the... Is parked the correct way? What? Okay, parked by the seashore. And I was wondering, what about paddles do they use? And then you find out, oh, they're engine boats. Just that the engines are removed at the end of the day. And then there's so many people. Why are they going to fit in and how will the fisher people bring in the catch? Okay, another thing I learned, all these people you see here are just helping to launch the boat. Only one person is going to go out with the boat. That's the power of technology. And then I have plans for sea kayaking, you know, soft launching. And when I saw this big boat being launched, I hmm, had to review it, but I'm still going to do my sea kayaking. But back to the boat. I was watching how they time the waves, how they time the incoming rollers, and then how do they nail the perfect one? Chalk it down to experience. Oh, this stretch of beach is by Hedge Resorts in Ibejuleki. Check them out on Google Maps. Now you need your engine to answer on the first pole. And check out those guys. They had to swim back. Talk about commitment. If you enjoyed this video, remember to press that like button down there and subscribe for more videos like this. With all the horses pushing the little boat forward, it wasn't long before he met the boat that had left earlier. He met up with all the other boats. They did whatever boats do when they meet each other. But let's come back to the shore. Let's look at this type of fishing that combines a coastal boat with people on land. I've only seen this in Ghana. Is it Federal Republic of Ghana or just plain Ghana? So the boats that go out lay the lines, lay the nets, and they now have people on the shore who are pulling in the catch. And this pulling is a lot of hard work. I tried the line. It's tough. Good thing is that it has seawater on it. So I guess if it cuts into your hand, it's going to be sterilized. But it's not something I wanted to find out. So those guys, they have like a piece of cloth wrapped around the line to stop such things from happening. So I followed the line inland and it went in for about a kilometer plus And it was pull, pull, pull. At first I was wondering, are they catching so much fish? Then I now realize most of the weight will be the net themselves. And because the line was cast so far out, they have to keep pulling. They start from before 7 a.m. And the ones I witnessed, they finish by up two hours. So I miss this guy jumping into the water because, I mean, he went towards the sea line and the next thing he just jumped in. So now the nets are closer to shore. They are pulling the nets. And I noticed that the people pulling the nets are also moving laterally. Aha! There is more than one team. This is a U-shaped net. So they are moving towards each other. Now the net is out of water. Nothing much to see and it was like, I hope these guys are going to catch something. So now a lot of hangers on have arrived. Most of them are traders, but there's this tradition that, okay, if you join in pulling the net, you get a little bit of catch. So enough for you to cook a nice decent meal. The jaws are closing and the two teams are almost touching each other. So now the net has closed. No room to run. Traders, hangers on, kids, everybody has now joined in at this point. 
This guy has some real stamina. So this is the end game. Two teams have met. Pull everything out. And then next thing is just separate the fish, count the catch, sell, and give it out. So there you have it. The whole process from launching the boat, pulling in the net, to sharing the catch. Hope you enjoyed it. Hey, don't forget to press that like button and subscribe for more videos like this showcasing Nigeria and West Africa. Thanks for watching.